Hello kings and queens, welcome back to my channel and if you are new here, my name is Wagoi Wabudia aka Gekoyo Woman. So today we are gonna do propagation of a Monstera Deliciosa. Let me tell you, first let me brag. You see that to plants hapo nyuma. Yeah, the idea is these are house plants and the reasons why I want to do this, this plant is very common. It's called a spider plant. It's very easy for beginners and it's very low maintenance. I've been a, pe I've been a plant parent for some time now and I'm feeling like I'm kind of confident enough to <laughs> give a little bit of information. But this is a Monstera Deliciosa. We're going to learn how to propagate it to get more babies and more plants out of a single plant. That is the meaning of propagation from my head, from the top of my head. And it's a big plant. It can grow in a small pot. It can grow in a big pot. It is low maintenance. It does not require a lot of light. And I know that's what you like. There are a variety. I wish I could get the white one. But the most common one of a Monstera is Deliciosa. So Monstera Deliciosa, this is what we have. And this plant can be propagated from the leaves or from a root. But the leaf is not directly the leaf. It has to have at least a stem or something. But for this specific day, today, now and here, we will propagate from the root. You can see that root. <laughs> that is what we will take advantage of. And that plant that protrudes from that root is what you hear my kikuyu. From that root is what we will use. So that's where we will cut. And we will store it in water for some days before we do the planting. So place a clear container and add some water. Then cut your plant. As you can see, one of the leaves is folded. And you place that plant in that water. You'll be exchanging the water maybe every two days. And it can also stay there and just grow there. It can grow in water, you know. But... At the end of the day, for this specific one, we will grow it in soil. But you can just leave it in the water. But make sure that you put new water every now and then. Make sure the water is not too high to prevent rotting. So place this under somewhere that it can get at least direct sunlight. Yep. But not scorching at the outside, somewhere around your window. So place stones at the bottom of your planting bowl and then add soil at the bottom of any kind of pot that will help you with uh, drainage then now you can put a hole where you place your plant you see the root has grown even the leaf has opened remember the leaf it was not that open when we were cutting it off the main plant and then now top up the soil make sure it's full enough and it's um drained well then now you water the plant and you're done i mean you have yourself a large plant i mean i don't know for you maybe it's your first but this is how you're able to share plants get more plants instead of keeping on buying now and then here and there so i hope you've learned something and if you're enjoying these videos please tell me to do more and uh these plants by the way most of them are on still. If you want one, contact me. Bye-bye.